Okay, good afternoon, I think. Yes, afternoon. Um, and this is Wargame Airland Battleland. In Wargame European Escalation, almost all player were gentlemen. No battle. Almost anyone uh, was nice. Got dude and nothing bad, but now I have watched this war game chat. Global war game chat. And what we have here, we have Iron Reigns and Mobilized Panda and some more people and they are, they have a word war. One say other and other one say something and uh, I think they don't like Iron Rage Iron Rake name and the we have I have seen little girl little girl little boy gay card and everyone le everyone and lots yeah in war game European explosion never so something like that or this this uh, global chat it could be good thing but because the people are so they are doing like this trolling just uh, yeah just you can see multiplayer session no any game all these people here just talking in the global chat and trolling each other. Why? <laughs> Ready to rock, Panda. <laughs> what is the point to talk on the chat so long? And just to say that someone is asshole and he should change his name and no. Ah, okay, now we go to what I think it I should what I will do in this video. Oh no there is games. I create one private great it's no matter uh, which one. Oh, let's take Hagway to Oslo, no enemy, and launch. I will just uh, tell something about this map. I'm not going to put any units on the map. Just telling me uh, which strategy I use in this map. Okay? We have two flanks. This is only helicopter flanks. Here you can send also ground units. Usually there is some fine fight in this forest. In this forest. And okay, if I start on this side map of map, I usually try to take. If I can, if I have teammates I try to go on this side because I don't like this side too much open areas uh, on this side there is this flank so I usually take some infantries in helicopters bring them down here here drop them off if I don't see any enemy helicopters or jets. I will uh, drop some units down here. Command vehicle here. 80 GMs and recon units here because then I can block this road. If I can, units here. Usually I am faster than my enemy, but here. Infantry is here. 80 games here, AA infantry is here. 
AA here, if you can take this, then here. And uh, recon, you need to worry about. Where was it? There was a point where you can see. Oh, recon units, if you catch this somewhere here, 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 somewhere, or in this house. And then, usually, when I, if I'm coming on this way, and enemy, I'm, I will take this, first this, and then maybe delta, and some infantry is here, some infantry is here, and infantry is here, something to block this, AA, maybe here, because it, then it's enemy AD games can snipe it down here, and recon helicopter if I have one in my deck, here. And then I will move my infantry using this flank here, somewhere here, using smoke effect to smoke down enemy units because usually enemy have infantry here. And then I move my infantry here and then start going this way. And when I have this somewhere here, I move. Alternate squad here, so the enemy is flanked, and of course moving infantry is here, here, as early as possible because I can uh, cut this road, and then here. Sometimes I will, if I have a fuel, I go all the way down here, and then here and block this way, because I usually use. Uh, Transport vesicles with auto cannons. It's really easy to block these roads with auto BMP 2Ds, Lab 25, and motors. And sometimes I send some heli infantry going this way, landing down here, and then some AA infantry is here. Really good choice. And then going around and come back and kill the CV. If you can kill enemy CV on their own, if they don't have other sector to call in, uh, or units like in this map, it's really important to kill enemy CV on Alpha or Hotel. Yeah, use these buildings. Good place to put some ATDM infantry. And if you see the enemy have command vehicles here, try to move here, here, and there because usually uh, players forgot to put something here. They just have infantry here because they are looking the middle of the map and where my units are or my command vehicles are, so flanking is always a good idea. And if you have uh, enemies, if you can move forward here or here, do some cheap units, tanks, usually tanks, some cheap AA and infantry with APC with at the cannon and then send them here through this highway. Really good. Usually, someone forgot to defend it, and you can just be sneaky. But don't use any expensive units because it's if enemy spot it, it's really easy to kill. Then, yeah. And make sure that the enemy can flank you from here. And then this flank, or this side of the map, here. Just go to Bravo. Nice road. And you maybe should, should send some units down here to take this air building complex farm. Is it farm? Looks like. 
now we can just industrial uh, industry area then uh, of course command vessel usually people put it here here but it's easy to kill by air strike or something so I recommend that you put it where it was here because this house will block enemy line of sight there this block enemy line of sight here and enemy usually fired here and here don't be where the enemy think you see this and yeah same here if enemy is not close they don't have any long range units then put your CV somewhere where the enemy sneakers can catch it. This is bad place because if enemies have infantry from here you can't run away. You have to go this way. So maybe CV should somewhere near road because then it can run away faster. Um, but Actually, this could be a nice, good place to put it down there because enemy can see it from here or here. Okay, if they come here, they can, but this sector is always really key. You need smoke to capture this sector. Lots of ro lo long range units and AA. Really open area. Same here. It's really hard to cross this area if enemy have AD games and heavy tanks here. So usually people use this forest and it's really easy to lose in forest or win in forest if you know what you do. So something here. Always try to block this. This building is in a good place. You can block the reinforcement sector and get lots of easy kills here if you... okay 80 games, 80 games, 80 games, maybe infantry okay if you are coming from this direc direction uh, uh, close quarters units here this house could place for 80 games infantry CV here. Somewhere, make sure that your enemy can snipe it down, and you should have some supply truck to repair it. Then, uh, stuff. Try to take these wood lines. Use smoke to uh, make your enemy blind. It's really much easier to take this if you are friendly or you have this already, because then you can give cover and then we can't use this to flank your units then uh, something maybe something rushing on this way jumping jeep and um, 10 heavy tanks here and clear the units down here then Smo if you have to capture the fox road, smoke this area usually people have something here but nothing in here smoke Lots of smoke, then drive here with infantry armor, infantry carriers, ABCs. Here, unload some stuff here. Maybe recon units to spot where enemy infantry are. More smoke, the, and you can make a re cut the reinforcement. And then try to sneak through. Yep. And you are here. And okay, if enemy have lots of stuff here, like artillery, helicopters, like I usually have, because this nice cliff blocked the weave, so I have usually my artillery somewhere here, and my helicopters, if I have, landed somewhere here. But here, yeah, sneaking through, going around, and then try to snipe enemy CV. Usually, 
too many times I have found the enemy TV just well, sitting there. Easy kill. Of course here. Yeah. 80 games here yeah. and quick on easy kill. But how to get some units, sneakers, infantry is here. Water block this side. Okay. One. Sometimes I have made it by bringing uh, infantries in heli and landed somewhere here and then moving up and healing. Sometimes flying here works because this forest nicely block enemy AA if because usually they have AA battery down here if they have landing there and then sneaking and killing. And this if enemy have golf not here. Uh, yeah they can't swim infantry can't swim so it's not helping. Okay how to capture this sector? Bravo Delta and Charlie is easy to capture by flanking them tenants jump from forest to forest and make sure that enemy is blind by smoking your enemy and lots of artillery fire to make them panic panicking usually <laughs> people use tanks lots of tanks and they are just here here in the forest and then use uh, attack and move command easily to move here if you have use it panic effect suppress suppression effect and use it artillery the tank can't fire back or are really bad only have bad shot so you can sneak bring your infantry in and kill all enemy tanks or infantry this, how to capture a bravo if you are coming from there. Okay, usually you should have eco first. Use this to flank this road to flank it. If you have delta it's much easier to take here. Yes, yep. Take this forest line, try to sneak something there on and in this building. Then something Recon units there on the ADGM team or on a heavy tank, then something here, smoke these houses, then move something here, smoke artillery to this forest and this line, and then go in, go in, kill the enemy. Of course, you have to, the situation can be so weird that. You have to do something weird. Okay, this you can come up with vesicles almost every side, yes. Yes you can. Okay. Usually enemy have CVs in this forest, in this forest or in this. I usually have it somewhere in the middle of this town. Oh and if you are losing and enemies somewhere here, here. Put recon units here, here, here. Okay, maybe here or here. And of course, infantry with close quarter weapons down there, there. Some tanks with this good in close range, like Russian anti tank anti. And the tank team, it's Vesicle, uh, B, B, D, M, T, I think it's B, D, M, T, no idea, but if I put it somewhere here, it have really good close quarter missiles, and will wipe out enemy, will, when enemy is rushing here, of course enemy will try to flank you. That's why you should have AD games here. But 
for attacking their infantries. Infantries sneak behind the enemy. Use this if you can use this flank. Use it. And yeah. Drive your units down here. I'll delay these buildings if and this forest. Napalm if you can somewhere here. I think the one Napalm strike can burn this. And this bay. One strike there, one strike there. No infantry is there anymore. And then just use smoke to smoke these areas and then rush in. You have to. You have to get your men. Bring your men here in these buildings, then you can sit and wait if enemy try to push you away, or you can go for forward and take them in enemy down. And of course, if you are here, when and it's in every forest here, here, every every forest, every down in a urban area, every urban area. When you are losing the sector, for example, this bravo. Okay, here you have still if enemy is here, you have still hope to push them back. Here maybe you have if you have artillery, napalm and lots of infantry here. Okay, good place to some napal units with napalm is here. And but when enemy is here, you can't push him away anymore because he had gets this town and it's the best way to defend. Maybe earlier if you recognize that enemy will take this. Don't wait until enemy is here. Run away earlier. Especially AA. Okay, man. When enemy is here. Start moving your AA back up and artillery, of course, is it's here. Tanks, everything expensive. Some cheap infantry can still uh, f stay here and try to get, but if enemy gets you are retreating here, enemy have tanks or any good units here, and then you start to retreat. You are somewhere here when enemy is here, and then you don't have any cover. You are moving, and the enemy have clear shot. And usually, if you don't use backup, if you tanks are going have weak side on this way, is to kill even heavy tanks. So try to back up before the enemy make uh, catch the whole sector because it's no point to lose units same here if enemy is here yes if enemy is you know that you will lost Charlie and you can't defend it fall back no why you should kill your units for nothing Put them here, go back, drive here, flank, and strike. Okay, if your enemy is here, you are, you have lost, or if you, you are on this side, you have win. So defend. So usually, uh, I really, usually it's not they. It's take only 10, 20 minutes to know which sides will win. So, and most people requit when they see that they will lose the fight. They just surrender and go to other and go to other game. But I always play to the end because I hate when people surrender middle of fight because I wanna fight it to the end and it's really fun to 
know that you are losing but still you can keep fighting and make sure that your enemy will, won't win and if you have time limit you can sit here or here and just killing enemy units and then time go to zero and you have more points because your enemy just r try to rush you rush you <sighs> yep don't recu don't surrender when things are horrible going from wrong in this game you got so fast these common points that you will catch new army in no time. Yay, thanks. But thank you for watching and hopeful this what hopeful this video make you a more player in this map. Use this forest, use smoke on here, of course in here, and try to take alpha or hotel down. So, happy playing, I am Tepoyat.